All right, so I wanted to come on and just talk about the Jersey thing that happened last week when I was dealing with the situation with Fluffy. Now, real quick, Fluffy is doing better. He's able to up and walk around. Um, he he's trotted a couple times. He does. He's not ready to try running, so I'm going to try him today. There are three steps from the outside that lead to the front door because it's raised up. So if he can do those three steps today, I might try him on the other steps of the house. There's two flights of steps that are six steps each, but if I bring him in that front door, he only has to go up one flight of steps to get up to the out upstairs. So that's a work in progress. I just don't want to do anything stupid, so stay tuned. All right, so the jersey thing. What is it? Three by three and a half. It's got to fit like in a three by three and a half rectangle. Ugh. So this this is probably a more touchy subject than politics because people are they're rabid about their jerseys and I get it to an extent, but there's some people that take it and they're just you know they're they're a lot more uh, animated about it. So. I get from, from that point of perspective, it's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Now, the question I have, and somebody can answer me this, I, I, I looked, I, I didn't read anything about it. My assumption is we'll still be able to buy jerseys without the ads, without the patches. That's my assumption. Now, this is supposed to make a lot of money for the league, and that's where, that's where the rub is. Okay, look, I've owned my own business for 22 years. If there's one thing I've learned is that if there's a way that you could bring in revenue, you have to look at it because the life comes at you hard. Business comes at you harder, okay? Business is constant, constant, constant change. And when you have that five-minute window where nothing is changing, you better be thinking about and preparing for the next change. Otherwise, you're out of business. Kaputs. So... From a monetary standpoint, I get it. I don't like it, obviously. Now, look, on, on the TV, let, let's be honest. How much of a difference is it going to make to some people, especially in the beginning, right? Okay, it's like if I, had, if I came on and I shaved the beard completely or left like some stupid Fu Manchu or something for about a week, everyone would be like, what the hell was wrong with Jaws, right? What, you look like some kind of freaking idiot. True story, my dad had the same beard, and one day he butchered it, and he shaved the whole thing down, uh, but he left the freaking long-ass mustache, and everybody at work, we were just we were just cracking on him for like for two weeks. Um, he, we called him a lot of names, which apparently now were politically incorrect, so I can't repeat them, but it was funny back then in the 80s when it happened. Hey, apparently it's not funny anymore. So, look, the thing with the, the ads, ah, damn, dude. Pandemic and look, the, the the league is we want the league to be good, right? I mean, look what happens when things aren't good. Look at the situation in Arizona with the Coyotes, right? I mean, that's a different. You know, the point with that is that if they if if, if there's a way to make that situation work, it has to be looked at. I know a lot of people don't like it. I'm not thrilled about it, but at the same point, I get it. I understand it. And every, everything changes, man. You know what I mean? There, there's nothing else in life but constant change. And this is just one of those things where, you know, the first year, it, it's going to suck. You know what I mean? It, where people, you know, it's, it depends on the jersey, right? Like like this jersey, um, well, they wouldn't be wearing this jersey anyway. So, but the point is, is like if, with a, if it's a darker color of jersey, it might be more difficult to see it unless they put like a big white patch on there, I guess. And, but on the home jerseys, or the way jerseys, the white ones, um, it's going to stand out a little bit more. It's going to be noticeable, especially because we're going to be looking for it, right? Now, as long as we can still go online and buy jerseys without the ads, wouldn't that be something? That would be... <laughs> I don't want to give them any ideas here, but if if they're really smart at business, you guys are going to hate me, but this is, I've been in business, so you have to find unique ways. If they're smart, they will actually make the jersey with the patch, the standard jersey, and if you want to buy the jersey without the advertising, it's more money. 
<laughs> oh, oh, you guys are going to kill me. <laughs> I, can, I can see the comments now. I, I'm sorry, but once the idea comes into the head, it has to come out. And that's why you guys watch this channel, so you have to take the good with the bad. Um, it's that would just be a smart business move, and I know you guys hate me for bringing that up. I'm sorry, sorry, it's a, but it's a good business idea. It really is. I want a percentage of that NHL. If you do that, um, I, I should get a cut. All right, I'm gonna go mow some grass. Literally gonna go mow some grass. So something's going to happen within the next couple of hours. It's guaranteed. Um, and then I'm gonna give you guys. Oh, that, the last thing here for those of you still watching tonight. About 9, 9.15, I'm going to be on the Hockey Nation live show. Uh, Coach Trenchy, he does live streams all the time on YouTube. Good good guy. He's going to have me on to talk about the Panthers. That's about 9, 9.15 Eastern Standard Time. Uh, I, it's going to be live. So I have no idea. Uh, hopefully I don't make an idiot of myself. I won't say anything stupid, all right? I promise. I'll make you guys look good. Other than that, I'm going to mow some grass. I'll let you guys know how it goes with Fluffy. Um, as, as soon as I come in from mowing the grass... I will see the big news, whatever's happened, and I'll make the second video of the day, and we'll go from there. Like, share, subscribe. I'll see you again later.